high speed chase crossed two counties today. It started after Deputy Sammy and stole an ambulance in Spartanburg. And during the chase, two law enforcement officers crashed. As Fox Carolina's Kennedy Harris shows us, this all came to an end with a suspect in custody in Union County. Very rare, very rare that we're chasing an ambulance, I'd say that. Union County Sheriff Jeff Bailey was taking a lunch break when deputies called, alerting him of a high-speed chase headed his way. Anytime you're in pursuit of a vehicle, it's it's serious, and especially a vehicle that size. I mean, you, you've got an ambulance, that's a heavy vehicle running at speeds of, you know, 90, 95 miles an hour. Officials say a man stole an ambulance from the Mary Black Hospital campus. Law enforcement from Spartanburg County and city began to chase him. When the suspect reached Highway 176 Pine Street, a city officer crashed near the one Spartanburg Chamber of Commerce offices. The chase continued down 176, reaching Union County around 1230. One of my deputies tried to box in the ambulance, and when he did, there was a... Uh, he, he ran off the road and the ambulance ran off the road and came back in and actually sideswiped the deputy and uh, that disabled that vehicle. Still headed towards downtown Union, Sheriff Bailey says the driver continued blowing through red lights and even a road construction zone before officers placed spike strips. We had a couple of those that, that failed at that point in time and we had another third one set up and, uh, and the actual front left tire of the ambulance was hit. The pursuit covered nearly 30 miles, ending here at the old Sims Middle School. If you walk this way with me, you can see the track marks the suspect left in the grass as he was driving the ambulance closer to the school. Police were able to take the suspect into custody safely, and no one was hurt during this pursuit. 34-year-old Terrence Darby is charged with reckless driving and failure to stop for police. It's a blessing that, that, that everybody made it out of this and, and no injuries, uh, not even the, the driver of the ambulance. Kennedy Harris, Fox Carolina News. Sheriff Bailey says they're reviewing body camera footage and more charges may be added later. Darby is expected to have a bond hearing tomorrow.